قول النبي صلى الله عليه وسلم يا بلال أرحنا بالصلاة He said, O oh, Bilal, Arihna, grant us rest by means of the Salah. From Ibn Qayyim, Rahimahullah, he says, There is no doubt that the Salat is the coolness of the eyes of al muhibbin those who love Allah and the Deen of Allah and the Messenger of Allah. And it is something that is tasty to the souls, the souls of the Muwahideen, the people of Tawheed. And it is a garden for the Abideen, the worshippers, the people who love to worship, who don't feel that worship is just a burden. Let's get this thing over with and get out of here. It is tasty to the souls of the Khashi'een, those who have fear of Allah. And it is the test to determine the condition of the Sadiqeen, those who are truthful. Yani the Salat is the test through which you can know those who are Truthful, and it is the scale of the condition of the Salikeen, those who are traveling on this path. And here, Rahmatullah al Muhadat ila ibadi al Mu'mineen. And it is the mercy of Allah. Yani Salat is the mercy of Allah, which He has given as a gift to His believing servants. So the one who loves Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, His rest and the coolness of His eyes. The comfort, the satisfaction, the joy of his soul and his heart is in salat. But the one who is unmindful, who turns away from the salat by either not pre- performing it, or not performing it on time, or not performing it properly and well, or not having concentration and khushu and reflection and contemplation in their prayer, the salat for this person is a difficulty and a hardship upon them. Whenever he stands, Whenever he stands in, the salat, in the salat, it is as it is though as he is though upon, upon embers, embers live, live, hot coals, hatta yatakhallasa minha, until he escapes from it. That's how people are in salat. May Allah save us from such a condition at any time, abadan. وَجُعِلَتْ قُرَّةَ عَيْنِ فِي الصَّلَاةِ But the coolness of my eyes, joy and satisfaction has been made in the salat. The real joy and real lasting and yani permanent happiness that never ends is not in ithr or food or your spouse or your children or the material things of this world, but it is in the worship of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. It is never it cut is off never cut if you are worshipping Allah, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. ta'ala. The, joy, the joy, the happiness, the happiness, and, the happiness and the satisfaction is permanent, is permanent, in, this permanent in this dunya for the one who is worshipping Allah. Allah. فويل للمصلين الذين هم عن صلاتهم ساهون الذين هم يراءون ويمنعون الم